So we're all very excited and um, especially uh, graduating from the IB program, which seeing what we have seen about the program so far uh, has been a very challenging and also rewarding uh, program. I'm really proud and for all the achievements that this, this school has provided, beginning from the teachers to the principal to the director, everybody. The only issue was that it was my teacher because like when you have somebody telling you they have so much confidence that you can make a seven and your teacher tells you like oh I have so much hope in you, trust me you make that seven. And also I realized that in English like I didn't put as much effort as I thought I should put in like earlier on because I believe I didn't know it. When I started putting in effort and my teacher started telling me like oh that he knows I can make a seven in the final exam, I realized that then what, what like why, why shouldn't I do that? Like why? So I started keeping in more effort basically, studying more in English, reading the books more and talking more to my teacher and how I can improve. Well, it's an amazing faculty, we have everything you need here from academics to food to agriculture, name it. You know, the, the, the IB program itself is a very rigorous program and it's a program that is so well sought after. However, it's, it's a program that people that want shortcuts don't go for. And all of these universities, they prefer, they actually prefer children that have the IB diploma. Why? Because already the groundwork has been done in preparing these children for university life.